friends. Today we're going to talk about the top five things to do on the Big Island. So let's just jump right in and I'll tell you our favorite things to do on this island. The first thing that we're going to talk about is the Hilton Waikoloa Resort. It is so fantastic. You do not need to stay here in order to come onto the resort. You do need to stay at the Hilton Resort in order to use the pool, but the grounds are fantastic. So let's jump in and I'll show you the different things on this resort that make it so fun to come and visit. If you do happen to stay at a Hilton Resort in Waikoloa, you do get access via a shuttle to come and use the pool. So that is what we did about every other day is we had something to do here at this resort. One thing that is a necessity is using the transportation on the resort. The shuttle takes you all the way around the resort, which is going to save your feet a lot of walking time. Another fun way to view the resort is to hop on the canal boats. Another fun thing to do on the resort is to come at sunset. They have the most spectacular views at sunset and this point straight out from here is so fun to come and walk out to. You also do not need to be staying at the Hilton in order to come and play in the lagoon. You can rent paddle boards, kayaks, they have a lot of water equipment that you can rent and get out on the water. Also at the Hilton Resort is Dolphin Quest. It is probably the highlight of our trip was being able to go and swim with dolphins. It is expensive, but to hear them, touch them, play with them, be in the water with them is something that we can't ever put a price on and we are so glad that we did it. You can actually just come and look at the dolphins anytime. You don't actually need to pay to do that. It's right there in the middle of the resort and it is just so fun to come and hear them and watch them play. Next up is Hapuna Beach. It is great for laying out on the beach, playing in the sand, or playing with boogie boards and splashing in the waves. thing you can do is after you've seen Rainbow Falls from the public side you can go and do a tour at OK Farms. You guys you have to go and immerse yourself into this farm. It is so fantastic. We did a two-hour tour that ended up taking three hours and they just talked to you all about their plants and their farm and you smell and you taste and you see and you feel. It is so fun. I'm not gonna give you any more hints. You have to go and do it. I'm not even going to tell you what this is or what this is. You have to go and experience it for yourself. Next up is Lava Lava Beach Club. It is the perfect atmosphere for beachfront dining. Lunch or dinner, it is perfect. Our favorite thing to do was just to hang out out there after we ate dinner and just enjoyed the sunset. Maybe it's something in the water, or maybe we just hit 
the end of the road Right now it doesn't even matter It's too late not to let it go And that's why I Wish you the best to say goodbye You start to get dressed and then we cry Cause we both know it's gonna hurt But not as much as this all right, you guys, that is it. That is our top five. But there's so much more to do and see on the island of Hawaii. So you have to just come and explore yourself. Go ahead and check out our other videos from our trip. And we hope you enjoy them. Take care and hopefully you subscribe and come back for more. Because we want to see you and chat with you and teach you all the things that there is to do about Hawaii and also our life back at home. Aloha. Take care. I know it doesn't even matter. See